I want to give you an overview really quick on how to use the scoreboard on the newer TrueScore software for the Dato scoring system. First of all, you just first of all you need to start the round and pause the round to edit the scoreboard. The scoreboard won't open unless you're in a match. Now I hit scoreboard and here's how the concept works. You've got time score and penalties. You can select what you're trying to apply, whether it's an award or remove, which color, and then you apply it. So if I want to go ahead and take a head strike and award it to red, that's how I would do it. See the score changes. If I want to go ahead and undo that head strike, instead of award, I'll do remove from red, there it goes. If I want to do a body strike, give a body strike to blue, this is how I would do it. I want to add a turn to red. Click valid turn. Click award. Let's go to red and apply. Okay, so again, what are you doing? Is it being awarded or removed? Who am I doing it for? and then this calculates the points and you apply. Same for penalties. Okay, if you want to add a Kyungo, click Kyungo, award to blue, and apply. So you gave a Kyungo to blue. Now usually you don't give them in the screen, you would uh, generally remove them, but you can do both. If I want to uh, remove that same Kyungo, click Kyungo, go to remove for blue, it's going to take off a half a point so you can confirm what it's doing. Hit apply. Now, uh, that's one valuable aspect of it. Then I'd resume the match. So now we time out again. And uh, say somehow the whole system locks up. You're completely don't know what to do. Well, you would restart the software. And when you restart the software, go ahead and... Um, start the round here all right so it locked up somehow and I'm back to round one or square one here I would just go ahead and quickly start the round stop the round with the timeout go right to scoreboard and I could configure what the score was it was one to one with a Kyungo so I go ahead and uh, can go ahead and say let's give red one now let's give blue one and I think blue had a half point deduction now there's only one problem I'm back at round one say we're in the middle of round two and all this happened go right back to scoreboard and you can put it right to round two with say say there was 22 seconds left on the clock you can apply all that so that's an example of how you recover from a, a system issue which doesn't happen often but there are times where you, know, you need to write down the score and reset the system. And then when I say done, I would just use resume to continue from that point. And there we go. It's a quick overview on how to use a scoreboard. Hope it's helpful. Thank you.